Hey everyone, uh, I was not expecting to be recording today, much like most people. Uh, Nintendo announced yesterday that they're going to be doing an Nintendo Direct uh, at 10, which is a horrible time for me because I'm at school, but I actually have a free period now, so I get to record this. I'm not going to try to, you know, talk too much because the Direct is about to start in like a minute. Um, honestly, only thing I really want is Mario Odyssey 2. I'll probably still be happy if like they show off Xenoblade 3 DLC. Don't spoil Bayonetta 3, Mario plus Rabbids info, hell, a new Star Fox game, uh, Kirby DLC, Kirby game. I'll be happy with those things, but the only thing that will actually get me, like, jumping and screaming with excitement, well, can't scream in here because I'm in a public place, but, uh, is Mario Odyssey 2. And honestly, I think Breath of the Wild 2 has a 50-50 shot of being shown here. I honestly think we might get it just its own direct. Uh, but yeah, that's the belt. Should be starting any second now. Wait, Mario movie. I'm Yoshiaki Koto. Oh my god, I forgot about the Mario movie. For today's Chris Nintendo Pratt. Direct. What the fuck? Wait, wait, wait. Are we gonna see the Mario movie today? Oh, wow! It takes two to tango. It takes two? Yeah, I'm gonna get this. Wait, is it cloud? Yeah, this definitely forward. looks like it's taking a hit in uh, the graphics, but I don't care. How am I supposed to play this game? You think I actually have friends? Or loved ones? Forbidden story begins. Is this fatal friend? Because I like horror. Wait, is this fatal frame? Are they bringing back fatal frame? Oh my god! That's fucking sick! Honestly, I thought it was done. I'm glad that they're still trying. I, I want to play uh, Made in Black Water. It's just, it's too fucking expensive to for the physical version. The memories and I always go for physical away. version. I already have a hundred hours in this game. Three I thought it was great. Don't want to get into spoilers. But all I'm saying is, is that challenge I would really... Oh, added. challenge back. Um, but I really Test want uh, combinations of the first two enemies. games to be in this game. Specifically the one, because I'm biased as all hell. Number 13. Why are you releasing everything in October? There's Persona 5 Royal, there's, um, Get drawn into these Nintendo Switch uh, games. there's, uh, Mario Plus Rabbids, and there's SpongeBob Bayonetta 3. Oh, SpongeBob, yeah. No, I might get this, this if it's good. Literally, there's like three games I gotta play coming out the same week in October. What the in fuck? Exercise mode. Oh my god, this is battles, fucking ridiculous. I love it. Oh, Tunic! Yes! Shore on a ruined island. Oh, I was so disappointed that I couldn't play because it was on Xbox. Action adventure game. But yeah, no, I really want... I'll, I'll definitely get this, but uh... Traverse the uh interconnected realms no, I, I, I hate reaction videos. The only time I'm actually fine with them are for like big, traps, big events like Nintendo Direct or other things. Um, but I don't want this to be a reaction channel. The only time I will ever do reaction videos are for Nintendo Directs. That is the only time. Oh wait, I know this game. Welcome back. It looks like it's running like shit though. Oh my god, this is running like shit. See the poppins. Their appearances will change over the years. That was like barely a Your difference. I can tell that the wave of like more. Animal Crossing's As influence is really change. starting to come in now because this can be unlocked. Um, story of seasons. <laughs> Yet they couldn't even do that for their own game. A lot of February releases. Today on Nintendo Again, Shop. I think there's gonna be a direct before After this. The game's launch, so that way they can DLC songs from the saga on them. series. A cosmic ah, there it is. is just around the corner. Yeah, don't spoil it. I saw the Wiggler fight. That was cool. Also, Raymond's back. Mario That's fucking Rabbids. amazing. Let's dive I can't believe exploration. Raymond is alive. That is really amazing. Well, yeah, no, I'm fucking hyped for this game. Especially for Raymond. I loved the first game. I thought it was great. It was hard, though. It was really hard at some parts. Yeah, I'm wondering how, like, the stages are gonna work, because you got to move around really freely. But, like, they had it on a grid based in the first game. So I'm wondering how that's gonna, like, work. I'm sorry, the word spark has been ruined for me by Xenoblade 3, because they would just say spark and, and uh, um, snuff instead of actual fucking shit. This is really just an anime direct. Again, I'm not really upset, honestly. 
Masters. 2022 has been an amazing year for me, like, in getting stuff I wanted. Not so much for, like, working shit, but it's been an amazing year for getting what I wanted. I got a 3D Kirby. I got Bayonetta 3. Well, I'm getting Bayonetta 3. I got Xenoblade 3. Again, Persona 5 Royal on Switch. Uh, Mario Plus Rabbids. Uh, there's probably more. I can't think of right now, but... I'm, I'm really good for this year, honestly. Are they announcing six already? Are they announcing six already? Plus, a new Rune Factory series will wow. launch in the future. That's that's how they announced it last time. I always think of the Etika reacting. More Nintendo 64 games are on the way. Conquer, give me Conquer. Pilot Wings 64. Oh, okay. That's not really a big. Cool. Mario Party. Did we not already have that? Oh, alright. Give me Conquer. Party two. Mario Party 2. Ooh. Yeah, I'll play Mario that. Party 3. Oh, wow. A lot of Mario Parties. Give me Conquer. Pokemon Stadium. Wow. Pokemon Stadium 2? Pokemon oh, Stadium wow. Wow, Nintendo. I'm actually surprised. And there's one more game we should mention. Conquer. 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 Give me Conquer. Give me Conquer. Goldeneye. Wow. Goldeneye, really? Oh my god. God damn. Re oh, with. Um, okay, that's sick. Like, maybe if it's not with the mouse and keyboard. But wow, that's a big announcement. Why was that already here? But that's sick. They know how big that game is. Honestly, I don't know if people are freaking out about Goldeneye. Because whenever I think people are going to freak out about something, they're always like, oh, that's cool. That's neat. But whenever I think something's like, you know, not that important, they're freaking out. So, don't know. I think it's a big, I think it's a big thing. I thought it was a really big thing that they brought over Earthbound and uh, Earthbound Beginnings. But a lot of people were like, oh, okay, cool. So I was just like, oh, okay. So keep them Fuck me, I guess. They dropped... Pun not intended. Not intended for a pun, but they dropped the ball. There she is. There she is. Why did it take so long? Why did it take so long? I'm happy that they're here, but... Why? Like, they dropped the ball with this game so hard. It's a lot of fun, and I really like it, but... God, the free updates, they gotta stop. They have got to fucking stop. Make a full game first, and then if you want to add more stuff later, that's fine. It's like, oh, we could have added this. It's just so disappointing how they handle Battle League. It's a lot of fun, but I, I've spent 25 hours in it, because I was doing the, the campaign. And it was hard at some point, but, uh... With your allies to activate various skills, you know, which can be swapped out. That's pretty much it. I still haven't played Wave 2 yet. I need to. Here's a sneak peek ah. at two courses racing Ew. into Wave 2. <laughs> that looks like a mobile game. Mary Mountain from Mario Kart I know it's from a mobile game, but that looks like a mobile game. Oh, okay. If they try to add every single course in this game. I'm fine with that. Why did they not just make a Mario Kart 9? I understand it's like, oh, because it's selling so well. But it's not going to make people want to buy Mario Kart 8 even more. I'd like to talk a little bit about Pikmin. It's been over 20 years since the first game, and we're still working on the series. Pikmin 4? Oh my god, Arlo. This is Arlo. Pikmin Bloom. It's Arlo a smart device game we started mind. with Niantic. The the I translator for Sakurai is Kyoto, back. I haven't heard him in a while. Pikmin 4, okay, come on. Now to the main event. Pikmin Please 4. Please take a look at this. Pikmin 4. Oh my god, it's Pikmin 4. Oh my god, it's Pikmin 4. I... I actually can't believe it. He was not lying. It was a development. It was a development. Arlo's losing his fucking mind. Arlo is losing his mind. Oh my god. God, he was not mine. It was close to development. Oh, it's Brittany. Get ready for a devilishly good Don't you dare spoil it. Don't you dare spoil it. Don't you dare spoil it. Oh, I'm so excited. All the music. It'll be over a year since it got announced. And five years since it got announced. I mean, shown off and direct. I'm so excited. Good. 
Good. Launching Didn't a spoil. Nintendo Switch Good. on Toby's Nintendo Direct. A new trailer delving more into gameplay will launch on our official oh. YouTube channel. I'm. I'll probably do a video for that. A dark fantasy mystery abounds from the creators of Danganronpa. What? Oh, all tribe is not happy. Welcome. I like Don. I like Don and Rafa. Many cases I like the first unsolved. one. I probably don't get it. I really liked the first game. I just what played Don and last year. Or this year. Uh, I really Gun liked it. I hated the third one. The second one I thought was fine. First one I thought was so good. I thought it was terrible, but so good. It's terrible, but so much fun. Yeah, this just looks like a Don and spinner. This is just Don and I cloud version. I've already played this. Why? Why cloud? God damn it! The cloud versions the just suck ass. Port, I, I played Resident this last year. I, I thought it was great. On Nintendo Switch, October it was. 28. I was so. You can download and try the out the free fuck? demo today. With all the October, on e late October releases, there are different dates. Three other recent entries in the Resident Evil series will be available as cloud versions oh, on right. Nintendo Switch. I still need to play two, three, and four. Why cloud? Stop with the fucking cloud. Kirby's oh Return my to God. Dreamland Deluxe is coming to Nintendo Switch. I was hoping for this. Oh, I'm so One happy. Day, a spaceship crash oh, I'm so happy. Oh, I'm so happy. Oh, Return to Dreamland was so good. I'm playing it again. I'm playing it again. I was hoping. I, I even said I was hoping for Kirby stuff. Blast oh, Mecca. From a distance, but, uh, or I was up close. I was hoping for Kirby stuff because it's, it's the 30th anniversary. I'm, well. I'm just so happy. I'm so happy. If you don't know, I'm a diehard Kirby fan. Ones like I'm Kirby. such a diehard Kirby fan. All oh, King Diddy is modeled after a Forgotten Lands. It ways. looks a little, a little, little, a little weird. I don't know, Kirby's but... Return to Dreamland Deluxe <gasps> launches on the Damn Nintendo it. Switch system February 24th, 2023. I, that's fine. That's fine. Pre-orders begin today that, on Nintendo that's fine. E -Shop. I'm I'm getting that day one. I'm As so part happy. Of Kirby's 30th anniversary. A remake of Kirby's Return to Dreamland will be released. It's like remastered. I so. hope you're looking forward to this game. I am very looking forward to it. One more thing. This next trailer will be our last announcement. Is it the Mario movie? Please take a look. Is it the Mario movie? I don't know, I got Kirby's Return to Dreamland. Mario Odyssey 2, come on. Come on. Oh, Breath of the Wild 2. I am surprised. I said it was a 50-50 shot. We'd either get it here or uh, the direct. Yeah. Um, you know, I'm excited for it. I, I, when that game first got revealed in 2019, I said it's coming out at 2023 at the earliest. At the earliest. And I've been right this entire time. Oh, right, we get to see gameplay now. That is Link. There go the deconfirmations. I want to play a Zelda. Zelda's so pretty in uh, Breath of the Wild. Uh, I don't. I like her long hair way more than the short hair. Wow. All right, wow me. You gotta blow me away. Make it scary. What is it called? Tears of the Kingdom. Oh, that's why there was like a raindrop or tear in the in the 20, 2021 trailer. May 12th. Wow. I am surprised. We're definitely still getting a a solo direct for it. Um, you know, again, I haven't really seen anything that's blowing me away so far about the game. Uh, I liked Breath of the Wild. Um, I thought it was, I thought it was great, but I think I have a lot of problems with the game, and I think that Breath of the Wild 2 can really improve upon them, but I still have a lot of problems with Breath of the Wild. I don't think it's a masterpiece. I don't. I think what they were trying to go for is a masterpiece idea. I think the world is a masterpiece, but I think there's a lot to improve upon, in my personal opinion. So I am excited for Breath of the Wild 2. Um, yeah, honestly, I can't really think of anything else, but like the biggest the thing I think that made me the happiest announcement was honestly it probably might be Return to Dreamland. Big ones were uh, for me. Return to Dreamland Deluxe, Breath of the Wild 2, Bayonetta 3, Fatal Frame was cool and the Danganronpa spinoff series is cool. It Takes Two was cool. Resident Evil games, they should not be on cloud. But that's it. I'm in a public place. Thanks for 
kind of be patient with this or just kind of sticking with this. All right, so for all of you that actually give a shit about uh, Bayonetta 3 and my reaction to it, I'm gonna be watching the Ways of the Witch trailer. Um, here we go. God. Not to step on anyone's toes. Why is it not hell of a show on the trailer? She's deadly. She's Bayonetta. She broke this Smash 4. Bayonetta gets a pass for being British. <gasps> Breakers of the Light remix. Breakers of the Light is my favorite song in Bayonetta. I love the remix. It's gonna be so good. Oh, I'm so excited for this game. Honestly. Like, I love Bayonetta 1 and 2. I think they both go hand in hand. I can't say which one's better. Maybe 2, but I can't really remember what happened in 2. Oh, wow. I get to summon more demons? I think that's new. This is like the last game of 2022 that I'm like so excited for. I mean, you, if you saw my reaction to this game, coming back from the live, coming back to life in last year's direct in September. You saw how happy I was. Like, when this game comes out, if I'm not finished with Mario Rabbids, this game is taking priority. Oh, that's cool. What is that background? That looked like Gower Plains. I do really like the big heavy weapons in these games. I like the guns and... I like this katana. That was fun. The abilities of infernal demons can also be used while exploring to find new oh, locations cool. and battles off the I hate bar. spiders, but that was cool. Does I always got like bronze or silver. Aim for the highest score possible. <laughs> These were so hard to do. I never got a gold. Biola's approach to combat is slightly different to the titular witch. For example, Viola can activate witch time by blocking ink. They said titular on purpose for Bayonetta. They said titular on purpose. Oh, she also has witch time. She can also summon a powerful ally in the form of the infernal demon bound to her sword. Oh, Alice in Wonderland. I was going to make a joke about Alice in Wonderland. No, that's just straight up Patricia Cat. Viola fights barehanded. Also, is that a joke to put... Uh, Bayonetta calls Luca, because she always calls him Cheshire. Oh, uh, there's gonna be, like, mandatory sections besides, like, the tutorial playing with her. Or can we switch between Bayonetta and Cheshire? Because I always prefer Bayonetta. Equip it, and you can target foes and dispatch them with graceful moves by simply pressing one button. <laughs> He's just pressing the same button over and over. That's a great option for those who only want to taste the battle and to focus on enjoying the story. He's literally mashing. That's what you already do in these games, but he's literally just mashing, just going. Can't wait to tap into Bayonetta's naughty side. Yes, I can't believe it. Five years. I'm so excited. God, just one month. Yeah, it looks great. I am just so excited. I'm so excited. Uh, the three biggest games that I was most excited for this year were uh, Kirby and the Forgotten Land, Xenoblade 3, and Bayonetta 3. Two of them are done, one left. This year's been great for me, honestly, for the getting what I wanted, as I said before. This was a fun direct. I liked it. I didn't think it was anything amazing, um, but it was fun. And a lot of really cool announcements, honestly. Uh, yeah, I'm incredibly excited for Bayonetta 3, since you made it to this part of the video. Um, yeah. Now, thanks for watching. Bye.